The Lesotho government has issued a travel warning for its citizens traveling throughout South Africa. It's asked travelers to be extra vigilant following reports of motorists being ambushed and pelted with stones as they pass through several towns in the Free State. Basotu, who were traveling in through the Free State, took to the social media with reports of motorists being pelted with stones, resulting in dented cars and shattered windows. Lesotho government has dispelled reports that these violent acts are aimed at Basotho. There has never been any Lesotho registered vehicle that has been reported, and I must repeat, reported, uh, in the South African police. There has never been such a report. Yeah. But uh, I cannot deny the fact that there might have been some incidents. Some believe that if these incidents are not arrested, they could hamper trade between South Africa and its neighboring states. People will be going to South Africa to come and eat a living, bring the little that they can back into the Lesotho economy. I want to bet, I have not done the numbers, but I want to bet whatever they bring back into Lesotho is far smaller, it's minuscule compared to what the South African financial services take out of Lesotho into South Africa. Right there, you just see how dependent the South African economy is to Lesotho, is to other neighboring states. The minister has further warned those traveling to be extra vigilant and plan their trips accordingly. We can just make a warning that we try, as a Lesotho nation, to try to, we should try to avoid using those uh, routes. And we are very sorry for those who have been affected. With the Easter holidays upon us, many will be embarking on their trips to different destinations. You are best advised to check with the local authorities to make sure that the route you will be embarking on is the safest. But if not, you can always rely on the SABC News app to be kept abreast with the developments happening on the route you will be in. Rapelang Khatebe, SABC News, Maserole Soto.